Hello friends, it is currently 1.29 on a Wednesday, February 7th. I'm not too sure where to start this video, but okay, here's the thing. I feel kind of sickly. I feel really under the weather. I don't know if you guys can tell with, with my face, but you know, I just don't, I don't feel 100% at all. I'm very sleepy, very exhausted. I think I got two hours of sleep last night. And I woke up at 5 a.m. today to drive down to College Town to attend classes, which by the way, the class got canceled, which kind of sucks. But I drove five hours on two hours of sleep, but that was not a good idea because because now I feel very drained, very exhausted. I just do not feel good at all. Not only do I not feel well physically, I don't feel quite well mentally and emotionally. It's nothing severe by any means. I've just noticed that in the past, I think two, three weeks, maybe the past month, I've been a bit under the weather. And it's not like much has changed in my life. I don't know, I just come home from classes and I just, you know, plop right in bed and fall asleep and then don't really do anything for the rest of the day. It feels like I'm waiting for something to happen, you know? But while I'm waiting for something to happen, I'm kind of letting life pass me by in a way. But you guys can even tell in the background, I have not made my bed. Um, you guys can't see the rest of my room, but thankfully, uh, it's kind of a mess right now. Uh, I'm getting to a point in my life where I'm just feeling a little cluttered and I feel like I need a change in my lifestyle. I don't eat enough, I don't drink water very much, and I don't get the right amount of sleep at the right times. But today that changes. I'm going to try and change up my lifestyle a bit. Um, I actually have some water here that I am drinking. I also had a protein bar. I know that protein bars are, you know, it's not a substantial meal, but by, you know, I, I just don't eat very much. I usually eat one meal a day, so I don't know, having one protein bar early is kind of good for me. But I plan on bettering myself. Cause I don't like the way I've been existing for the past month. I've been exactly that. I've been just existing, waiting for something to happen for whatever reason. I need to be productive. I need to work on things. I need to find stuff to do. I need to, I just need to focus on myself. I just need to change my lifestyle. But a lot of people tend to come to my channel and say, oh my gosh, you're so positive all the time. You're so happy. Oh my gosh, you were just looking through rainbow tinted glasses all the time. How do you do it? And I mean, don't get me wrong. Yeah, life is amazing. I love life. Super positive, super happy outlook all the time. It's just my rainbow glasses are a, a little bit a little bit dull right now. They need to be shined up a bit, you know? I don't quite feel like recording a video right now, but I do want to better myself and I figured, you know, hey, I'm gonna bring you guys along for the ride because as positive and happy as I am, it's also good to, you know, be realistic on my channel. Like, yeah, guys, I'm feeling a bit down. Let me just take you all along for the adventure of me trying to cheer myself up. But I'm gonna be totally honest, y'all. I feel like crap right now. Honestly, since I had to do that five hour drive on two hours of sleep, oh my gosh. And then my class was canceled too. Oh my God, that did not make me very happy at all. Ooh, I was not a happy camper. I think the first thing I wanna do on this quote, quote, pursuit of happiness is uh, take a nap. I know that sounds really counterintuitive to what I wanna do because I do wanna sleep, but I wanna sleep at the right time. And as of right now, it is, you know, 1.30 <laughs> p.m. <laughs> but I think I'm gonna go ahead and clean my room a little bit and then maybe set an alarm, just take a little baby cat nap because I really am not feeling good. It's not, I'm, I'm physically not well right now and I just need a little bit of sleep. Time to set an alarm. Alexa, set alarm for four o'clock p.m. Alarm set for 4 p.m. Wonderful. <sighs> Hey friends, remember when I said I set an alarm for 4 o'clock? Yeah, that didn't quite work out very well. Nice. I'm in a major grumpy mood. I slept for way too long, but um, I definitely need to get up and get rolling because I feel like crap. So the first thing I definitely need to do is get some food in my system. So I'm going to go to Subway. I'm going to get me a sandwich with greenery on it because greenery is very good for you. And if you want to feel good, you got to eat good. And when I get back, I am going to eat my Subway sandwich. I am going to clean my room because I really need to. And I'm probably going to work on some homework and study because I do have an exam tomorrow. And I'm definitely going to drink some more water because I'm really dehydrated right now. So I will see you guys in a bit. Hello. I got Subway. Got myself a lovely six inch ham on Italian bread, which is one of my favorite combos. I went ahead and made my bed as well, and I gotta show you guys something else too. I went ahead and just cleaned up my room. You can actually see the floor in my room now. Look at this. I can use this mirror for selfies now because, you know, this place isn't completely cluttered with just a bunch of madness. You can actually see the floor. Ah, sometimes I forget what color carpet I have. I feel like if I clean my environment, I just function a lot better. So now that I have a clean environment, I feel like I can do the things now. First things first, I'm gonna eat the Subway sandwich, gonna work on a little bit of homework, and maybe play some Fortnite. I think that sounds like a solid plan. He is a bobo snake. 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 Hello. How are you doing today, buddy? How are you doing? I wish the camera would focus on you, but it just does not want to, so it seems. Focus on the pretty snake. Come on, you can do it, camera. You can do it. 
Okay, I guess not. That's fine. Look at the glory that is this sandwich. Look at it. It's about 1 o'clock in the morning now. I've finished eating my food, and I'm going to go ahead and go to sleep, get a wonderful night of rest. Hopefully, I will wake up, and I will feel a lot better. Good morning, friends. It is February 8th. 9th? What day is it today? <laughs> it's the 8th. It's February 8th, and today, I want to focus on getting two meals in. I also have an exam. Uh, I'm about to go to class. I have my backpack on. Just showered. I'm feeling really well-rested, actually. But I'm going to go ahead and take y'all along for the ride, so let's go, because I'm going to be late. <laughs> Can y'all see inside the classroom? My class got canceled. Sweet. Great. So since my first class of the day was canceled, I'm actually gonna go ahead and get my first meal of the day in. Uh, I'm gonna go to Starbucks, maybe get a hot chocolate, maybe treat myself a little bit. I don't know yet. Thank you so much. Look at my snake all coiled up. Look at where his little head is. Oh, what are you doing, Poe? You're so cute. Hello. Good morning. Good morning, Popo Sneak. Hello, Sneak. Ooh. Hello, Sneak. How are you doing today? Good morning. Are you blah, 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 blah? Yes, he is. This is my snake. My snake is amazing. Hello, friends. It is currently 9 at 50 on the same day. Uh, I took a two-hour nap, but I did a lot of homework. I did some laundry. Uh, I did a lot of stuff, actually. I was super productive, and then I decided, you know, I'm going to treat myself, take a little cat nap, so I did. It was only for two hours this time, though, not, like, however long it was yesterday, six, eight hours, so... You know, two hours is pretty good, and uh, I have some pizza. I'm gonna stream right after, but I gotta show you guys this pizza because it is magnificent. I know this may look gross to some of y'all, but this is a porky mac and cheese pizza, and it is so heavenly. It is so good, and I cannot wait to eat it. But after eating my pizza, I do plan on streaming, and for those who don't know, I do stream on Twitch quite often, so feel free to follow me over there, twitch.tv slash noisybutters, and I will see you guys there. Hello, friends. I am here actually live streaming. It is currently like 1.30 in the morning, and I am live streaming. See everybody in the chat. Say hi to YouTube. Say hi to YouTube. Oh, we got a subscriber! Oh, thank you so much, that tech dude! Thank you! Hey! Hello, world. Hello, world. What up, YouTube? Hey, how's it going? <laughs> oh, look at all the emotes! Oh! <sighs> I just finished up my stream. It is currently about 3 a.m. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and go to bed just so that I can stay on a good sleep schedule, but uh, I feel very happy right now. I'm in a very good mood. I feel very accomplished. I had a very big day today, finishing a lot of homework assignments, studying for an exam, and streaming as well. Uh, hopefully tomorrow or the next day I'm gonna be able to get a video up, which would be even better. But I'm feeling a lot better. Genuinely, I'm feeling a lot better. I am going to chug a cup of water and then go to bed and see how I feel in the morning. Hello again, friends. Today it is February 9th and it is 6.45 p.m. I woke up at about 10 a.m., but I decided to take a little nap and I slept until about 2. So I guess it's not too bad. I think my sleep schedule is getting a little bit better, but I'm, I'm not sure. But I have an important gaming community collegiate meeting thing. I don't really know what to call it. In about 15 minutes, so I'm about to go head out there, do what I gotta do as president of a gaming club. And I also plan on giving this source shaker to one of my that I actually know in real life. I think he's gonna love it, but let's go. We're gonna be late. Now it's time to find the nerds. I don't know where they're at. They're somewhere in this building. I just don't know where. Look at this big old group of nerds. Oh my god. <laughs> Yo! Yo! How's it going? You were the goat? Hello? The only person that's not a driver is uh, Polio. Steel, ATK, Swag, Polio, and uh, Hound, yeah, Ruben. Damn. Rufus. Yo. Let's go to um, Taco Bell. Yo. Alright, just talk about it. Yo. Who do I give this to? Who do I give my sister? Guys, this is what democracy feels like, everybody. Hell yeah. This is what democracy feels like, everybody. This is what democracy feels like, everybody. Hell yeah. Trying to get into focus, it's not focusing. <laughs> Take over. Take over? Oh, like, so I can look cool? Yeah. Hang out with you? Just take over. Take over. It's okay. Charge the block now, bro. Well, Start well, well this, I, I don't know how to do this. Will this make me famous? Yeah, it will, bro. Oh, oh no. Yo, I used to try to do it on my phone. This one. Isn't that so much better? Yeah. Like, that's, that's so much better. That good quality. 
What up, Ryan? Oh, you gotta take over. She wants to take over, bro. Come on, bro. I don't I don't vlog. Everybody else already did. <laughs> I don't vlog. My hair's all messed up. I don't look good. I don't, I don't Top 20 in the nation PUBG right here. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not even in the front. I wasn't even in the front. Bro, 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 bro. There we go. That means the height difference. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's only six inches, bro. It's only this this you gotta do it like this. Just get six inches. That's six inches. <laughs> Hello friends, I just got back from that big old meeting. I had a lot of time to hang out with some people, get my socializing in for the day, so that was really good. I went out to go eat though, and I just could not eat. I don't know what it was, but I just was not hungry. So I went ahead and got a little bit of caffeine. This is cheer wine, actually, if you guys ever heard of it. It is a fantastic beverage, but I'm gonna drink this for a bit, see if it stimulates my appetite anymore, and I'll probably be editing a video or two. I think that's what I'm gonna do for the night. Three, two, one, wah. Oh, it's fine. Three, two, one, wah. Hello today, friends. What day is it today? What day is it today? It is February 10th. It's a Saturday. And I feel reborn. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's from drinking a whole bunch of water or getting a good night's sleep. I haven't taken any naps today or anything. I just got done editing a video. It is rendering right now, as you guys can tell. And I also plan on streaming as well. And guys, check this out. Oh my gosh, look what came in today. Look at this. What is this? It's a flying butter stick is what it is. It's my apparel. Oh my gosh, today has been such a fantastic day. <sighs> I don't know, I'm just in a really good mood today. The more productive I am, the happier I feel. And the more I drink water and eating greens, oh my gosh, I had Olive Garden today and I had a salad. Oh my heavens, that is the best salad I've ever had in my life. But today has been an absolutely wonderful day. I don't know, I just felt very happy, very productive and I don't know, I feel like I've I've definitely changed in the past couple of days. I don't have the same mindset as I did a couple days ago. Good morning, friends. Today it is Sunday, February 11th, and it's about 2.30. I actually woke up at about 1 o'clock, so I am craving a hot chocolate. I am just randomly like, yo, I want a hot chocolate. So I'm going to get a hot chocolate from Starbucks, and I guess I'll see you guys when I'm back. I'll take a venti hot chocolate and a sausage, egg, and cheese, and that'll be all. Oh, and a cup of water. I'll take a cup of water. I went ahead and got my Starbucks, and I also decided to pick up a cup of water from Starbucks. Because last time I went to Starbucks with the Sore House, they were saying that the Starbucks water is heavenly, it's amazing, it's the best water they've ever had in their life. And I'm like, guys, it's water. What are you talking about? So we're going to find out what they're talking about right now. I mean, it's good. It tastes like water. I mean, <laughs> I'll take it. It's water. Hey. You know, actually, that is really good. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, it's really good. I think the plan now is to just hang out a little bit, catch up on social media, and drink my hot chocolate, and just chill out for a bit. Cause sometimes it's just good to have time to yourself, you know? <laughs> Hello friends, it is currently 1.23 on February 12th. It is a Monday. Today I went to class and it started off a little bit rough. You know, I had to present something and I was a little scatterbrained on it. I'm like, oh my God. So that kind of, you know, that made me feel a little, a little down, but then all of a sudden I asked a really good question and my, my professor was just like, that is an excellent question. Good job, Hannah. Gave me like a fist bump and everything. I'm like, oh, oh, today got so much better. This is amazing. <laughs> so now I am extremely happy and I am drinking my smart water and working on some homework, but I want to take this time to reflect on the past week. I think I vlogged about four, five, six days, I think. And when I started out this vlog, I was feeling very down. I was feeling very out of it. Like, I don't want to say I was depressed per se, but I was definitely feeling more numb than normal. I was a little sad at the same time and there was no reason to be. I really just wasn't in the right state of mind that I'm used to, you know? That's when I decided to take a step back and say, look, okay, I'm in charge of my feelings and I choose to feel happy. Let's work on feeling happy for the rest of this week. That's what I did and I feel amazing now. I don't know. I feel rejuvenated. I think, um... A lot of the things that I did in the past week really helped out with that. First things first is drinking water. I was chugging these things like crazy. <laughs> if I woke up in the middle of the night, I'd be like, oh my god, I'm really groggy, but I need to chug a cup of water right now. I would just, I would chug water. I would drink as much water throughout the day that I could. Water is a wonderful substance. It is the substance of life. And it helps you look better and feel better too. Like my hair feels better, my skin's a little bit more clear. I also focus on eating at least two meals a day. Well, I don't want to say two meals, but I focus on eating two times a day. For example, I'm not really a big fan of eating too much early in the day. I don't like the uh, breakfast time. I like breakfast food, but not breakfast time. So instead, I eat usually a protein bar or something really small in the mornings. And then later on in the nights at about 9 or 10 o'clock p.m., I eat a big old dinner. And eating a little meal at the very beginning of the day just made me feel a lot better. It gave me a little bit of energy. What else did I do? Sleep. I slept. And I slept at the right times for the most part. I did take a couple of naps. I did sleep during the daylight a little bit. There's nothing wrong with naps, but as long as you sleep, you know, as long as you're getting a good amount of sleep and you're not missing out too much on daylight and you're waking up decently early and all that jazz, naps are okay, but 
not too many of them. Two weeks ago, I would have probably taken a nap at about this time, to be honest, but right now, I'm up and at it. I'm about to record a video, so I think I got my sleep schedule figured out somewhat. What else did I do differently? I socialized with people. I went out and I went to cook out with some people and we were hanging out and, uh, yeah, there are a bunch of gamer nerds and we just talked and hung out and you know, social interaction is really important. Just getting out of your apartment and doing something for the day or your house, I guess, just going out and doing something is so important and so healthy for your mind. Even if that means going to Subway or going to somewhere to just pick up food or something, like just talking face to face with people does a lot. Like earlier this week, I went to Subway to pick up a sandwich and when the guy handed me my sandwich, he had this biggest smile on his face and it made me so happy. You see, when you're stuck in your apartment, you miss out on interactions like that. Or home, I should say, I'm used to saying apartment because I live in one. What else did I do? Uh, I stayed productive. Oh, I did work. Oh, I did a lot of homework. I did a lot of studying. Surprisingly, I did a lot of um, uh, streaming. <laughs> I forgot the word. I made a couple YouTube videos as well. I just worked on my online personality stuff, answering a lot of business emails and whatnot. Staying productive and moving forward will do a lot for your mindset. Something I did notice and something that I wish I did differently, I wish that I would have woken up and started with a shower every single day. There were times I woke up from a night of sleep and I rolled over and went, oh my gosh, it's noon. I totally should be getting up and starting my day, but I was like, man, I don't feel like getting up. I don't want to move right now. And honestly, a shower would have helped out so much with that. Just a splash of water on the face wakes you up so well. But for some reason, I'm like, nah, nah, it's fine. So if there's something I definitely want to do from now on, it is to just start with a shower every day. Just, just, just go hop in the shower no matter how groggy I'm feeling, no matter how crappy I'm feeling, no matter if I'm saying, oh my God, I don't feel like getting up. I just gotta do it. Just gotta hop in the shower. It'll wake me up. It'll get me energized and it'll get me ready to go for the day. Another thing, I've also kept my room relatively clean. You guys probably can't tell right now. Actually, I'll just show you guys. I've kept my room pretty clean. As you guys can see, the floor is not messy. I just have like a pair of shoes and my keys over there. But just keeping my room clean has really helped out with my mindset too. A cluttered living slash work area will definitely clutter your mind. So the more that you unclutter, the better you will feel. I guess another thing worth noting is that every day I try to do something a little bit different with my daily routine. Too often we get stuck into this daily routine of, you know, waking up, going to school, having lunch, having the same snack, maybe going out seeing our friends, going to soccer practice, and then going home and going to bed. It's, it's too much. It's way too much of a routine. You gotta mix it up. You gotta mix it up in your life, even if it's something small. Like for example, I was at class and instead of taking the short way home, I actually took the long way home and I played a little bit of Pokemon Go. And it was really nice. It was very refreshing. It was something small and it was, you know, gaming related, which kind of helped, but you know, it was, it was still beneficial. It gave me a nice change of pace, if you will. I also had a little bit of me time every day to just kind of, you know, browse the internet, browse the social networks, and just kind of get into the more nerdy things that I really enjoyed. Like for example, I ended up catching up on the Attack on Titan manga, which I love to death. Oh my gosh, guys. If you guys ever read a manga, you have to read Attack on Titan because oh my gosh, it's so epic. It's so good. I love it so much. Oh my gosh, I can't even contain myself. But I managed to find time to catch up on the Attack on Titan manga, and I don't know, that was just really refreshing for me too. While it's good to socialize, it's also really good to have your own me time. The individual time with one's self is very important. It's a time of self-reflection and just enjoying your nerdy hobbies, I guess. And I think that's pretty much everything I want to talk about. I don't really know how this video is going to turn out, but I'm just going to go ahead and show you guys the transformation, if you will, if there even really is much of one, from when I was feeling a little sad to feeling happy over the course of, what, five or six days? So if you guys enjoyed this video, please be sure to drop a like. I would really appreciate it. A lot of people tend to ask me, Butters, how are you so happy, so positive all the time? Well, you know, I'm not. I'll be honest. I'm only human and sometimes you gotta take a step back to really get in tune with your emotions again. I finally did and I feel so much better. Friendly reminder, what I did for myself to make myself happy might not work for everybody. So if you are unsure about being in control of your emotions and your feelings for whatever reason, if you feel like, oh, I can't be in control of how sad and how numb I'm feeling, I'm not the kind of person to diagnose that. I would recommend just going to any professional that you can and getting a diagnosis from this. I recommend going to a professional for that. I cannot diagnose everybody who watches this YouTube video. If you're unsure about how you're feeling, definitely go seek professional help if you need to. There is absolutely nothing wrong with that. We're all human, we all feel down, it's okay. The important thing is getting back in control of your emotions. Anyways, like, comment, please subscribe if you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching and I will see you guys in the next video of whatever I make. Bye bye <laughs> Da